go. Okay, take two. Big sister and little sister. That was not a two minute video. Mm mm. By Charlotte Zolato. Can we play Taboo now? Yeah. Zolato? No one? <laughs> Zolato. Zolato. Little sister would sometimes cry, but big sister always made her stop. That's not healthy. First, she'd put her arm around her. Then she'd hold out her handkerchief and say, here, blow. <laughs> what would we do without these sound effects? <laughs> the daisies bent back and forth in the sun. A big bee bumbled by. The weeds scratched under her bare legs, but she didn't move. She heard Big Sister's voice coming back. It came closer and closer and closer, and suddenly Big Sister was so near, Little Sister could have touched her. But she didn't. It doesn't say that, Emily. Big Sister sat down in the daisies. She stopped calling, and she began to cry. She cried and cried just the way Little Sister often did. When the little sister cried, the big one comforted her. But there was no one to put an arm around the big sister. No one took out a handkerchief and said, here, blow. Big sister just sat there crying alone. Little sister stood up, but big sister didn't even see her. She was crying so completely. Little sister went over and put her arm around big sister. She took out her handkerchief and said kindly, here, blow. <laughs> big sister did. big sister did then the little sister hugged her where have you been big sister asked never mind said little sister let's go home and have some lemonade and from that day on little sister and big sister both took care of each other because little sister had learned from big sister and now they both knew how the end. Age of four to eight.